All right, so the first time that you click the sync button, it's going to ask to install OneDrive on your computer. This is the Wonderlar tenant, and this is my OneDrive. So you can see these files, you can see that those are the same folders and files that I just saw in the OneDrive in the browser. And I can work on them from here just like in the browser and then have different little cloud icons here as well. So for example, this little icon with a little person next to it means that those are shared. I can also choose to always keep on this device. So if this is a file or folder that I use all the time and I need these files to be just quickly accessible on my computer, I need to be able to get to these files offline then I can choose always keep on this device and it will actually download all those files that stay synchronized with the copy that is in the cloud. I don't recommend just doing this for all of your files, but if you have just maybe one specific folder that you always need, then I would use it that way. So if I choose always keep on this device, then you can see that it's got a different icon now. So now and I can do that for specific files as well. Always keep on this device. And then the, fi the files and folders that I'm always keeping on this device have a different icon. So when I go to this folder, now all the files inside of that folder also have that icon, letting me know that that copy's on my computer.